Hi there, Ian Dixon here. How are you doing today? So um, today's tip, uh, five, six minutes, I'm going to share with you um, a networking tip to, to help you with your business networking um, to do with how you go about networking and your approach to networking to get the very best out of it. So if you are somebody that goes business networking or somebody that knows that they need to go business networking, then this might be useful for you. Uh, so stick around five, six minutes. Uh, please do help me by clicking on to the uh, subscribe button. That will be very helpful. Uh, but if you're ready, then let's get into it. So business networking, um, this is really more um, an approach uh, thing and a, a mindset thing that completely changed the way in which I go about my networking. So, and I still to this day see so many people go in networking with uh, business networking with uh, the expectation that they're going to get business. And they stand up and <clears throat> uh, they'll pitch uh, their products and so like literally pitch their products and services. If they have a one-to-one -one with somebody, they pitch their products and services, uh, and then uh, they basically stop going networking because it doesn't work. And uh, whilst uh, those things aren't necessarily the wrong thing to do, uh, certainly for me, it wasn't a way in which I wanted to network. And so I <clears throat> broke down the whole, you know, I, 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 uh, because I, I was going to stop networking, essentially. I, I was finding that um, exactly the same way. I wasn't getting anything from my networking and uh, couldn't understand why. And then I, I had a bit of an epiphany really. It, it was actually, <laughs> I, 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 in my mind's eye, I could see the name above the door, which was networking. And it was then really a, a big, big mind shift for me as to why I was there. And rather than be there to get business, I went networking to grow my network. And with that came some other uh, interesting attitude changes and approach changes to how I would um, metaphorically work the room. And I, uh, this probably goes back 12, 13 years. Um, since that time, I now network specifically to grow my personal business network, but also to uh, to help and support others so so I don't go networking for me I go networking for others so whether that be to connect people in the room or whether it be to um, help and support uh, clients you know my clients that either haven't got the time to go networking or struggle to you know get the best out of their networking um, I, I will often network on their behalf as in you know they're in my head and if I'm sat with somebody that's looking for a web developer for example um, and uh, uh, I know you know one of my clients is a web developer of course I'm gonna uh, pass on that 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 piece of business um, lots of things changed as a result of me changing my approach and attitude to networking the the first and probably one of the most important things that changed is that I let go of all expectation on uh, getting new business from, directly from uh, business networking. When you take all that pressure away and that expectation away and you get up in the morning and know that, you know, I know e even though um, I, I'm not necessarily chasing down new business, uh, I, still, I still go networking. It's an important part of my marketing strategy to continue to grow my network. And I would add that I think that it's even more important in the world we live in today with all of these social networks to actually physically network. So uh, because you get a double win. If you sit down with somebody uh, that, uh, that you physically meet and you exchange business cards, 10 years ago, that unless there was a phone call and then a cup of tea away from that networking event, that was kind of it. Well, nowadays, I can sit down with somebody that I meet physically at a networking event, exchange business cards, and then I'll connect with them on LinkedIn, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, you know, um, in, uh, all of the social networks, depending on what's relevant to them. So um, the, it works the other way too. So if I connect with somebody on LinkedIn, for example, and then I go to meet them at LinkedIn Local, um, I get to uh, physically meet somebody that I've connected with on a virtual network. 
Uh, the other thing is that once you physically start networking with somebody and uh, you connect with them in a virtual way, uh, they are far more likely to give you a thumbs up, a share, a comment, a reconnection with somebody else, uh, you know, an ongoing connection. So, so um, uh, networking itself has stayed in the top three things that any business owner should be doing to promote, grow and market their business. It continues to, to, to be so. You know, I, I still uh, am out networking every single week. Um, and I don't know that I would be if I hadn't changed the way that I think about what networking is. Um, I'm going to do another video on the different flavors of networking because, it, you know, networking isn't just a thing. It's a bit like saying, um, <laughs> I'll give you a good analogy. So networking isn't like ice cream. Networking is flavors of ice cream. So there are lots of different flavors of networking. And consequently, some of those flavors, you have to approach those in a different way. So, uh, but the most important thing and the biggest share really is about 12, 13 years ago, I had a completely different approach to uh, how I, and, and my expectation of networking. And I now go very much with a, um, a giving uh, attitude. You know, I go for others, not for myself. Um, uh, and my primary purpose there is, is to be able to cross connect in, and introduce people and to add people into my network so that they uh, help me to grow my network. Uh, because the bigger my network is, the more likely it is that someone somewhere along the line is gonna say, you need to speak to this guy. So there you go, I hope you found that useful. Um, just a, really a simple mindset um, attitude and approach to business networking. Hope you found it useful. Uh, please do um, click on the subscribe and ding the bell. It would be very, it would be very helpful. Um, and we look forward to catching up with you on the next video. Bye for now.